And it's Ken Kreitzer for CBSI Services. We're at the Westchester Business Expo, sponsored by our friends at the Westchester Business Council. And get a chance to talk with John Rabbits about it, one of the executives of the council. John, look like you had a big crowd at your expo today. We did. This is the 14th year that we've run the expo. Uh, we knew we were going to have a great day today because we sold out our booths about three weeks ago. And so I think enough businesses of all different sizes, of all different industries, know that today's a day for them to be in this hotel, to be exhibiting their, their businesses, to be meeting other businesses in Westchester County, to build relationships. And so the energy that we had on the two exhibit halls uh, was phenomenal. Well, absolutely. You couldn't get a parking space here at the, at the, at the Hilton. And John, if you would, just tell us a little bit about some of the companies that uh, participated in the Business Expo today. It's seen a wide variety of both small and large firms. We, did. we had over 150 businesses participate, and they did range from some of the larger corporations that we have in Westchester County to a lot of the professional service firms, Empire City Casino, which is one of the largest employees in Westchester County. Uh, and then we had some non-for-profits, and it's important for non-for-profits because they are businesses that need to be able to build relationships uh, with other businesses to support their cause. Very good. If you would tell us a little bit about the Business Council. I know you have programs uh, throughout the year. Well, we have about a thousand members and they range from the multi-international companies that call Westchester Home, MasterCard, Pepsi, IBM, uh, Heineken USA. We have all the hospitals and universities as members, uh, professional service firms, biotech firms. 120 non-for-profit firms, uh, non-for-profits that are members. And then we have the small mom-and-pop businesses, businesses with five to ten employees, and then our solo entrepreneurs. And we have really three goals for our members. One, we want to help them grow. We want to help them build their businesses by putting them in situations like today where they can meet other businesses that hopefully can do collaborative work. Uh, we want to market their businesses through all of our different platforms that we have in terms of marketing. And then we advocate for them on all levels of government to help them uh, really interface with elected officials who might have legislation that either can be helpful and we want to support that. And in some cases, legislation that can, be, uh, can really cause a lot of problems for them. And we want to oppose that legislation on their behalf. Well, I know you have uh, you have uh, some big dinners during the course of the year. You have an awards dinner, uh, uh, and I believe that's when is that coming up? That's going to be at the end of April, and it's again our Hall of Business Hall of Fame. We honor six businesses in different categories. We get about 600, 700 people uh, to attend that, uh, and if people go to our, on our website, which is the bcw.org, they'll learn all about it. And again, anyone who wants to do business in Westchester County really should be in that room that night because again, it's a great opportunity to meet folks. Well, sounds great. John Rabbits, I've known you in a couple of your occupations. Uh, tell us a little bit about the path of your career. Well, I started my career in uh, politics. I was a state assemblyman for 12 years, representing part of the east side of Manhattan. Uh, I then came to Westchester County uh, to head up the Red Cross, to be the CEO of the American Red Cross in Westchester County. Uh, and that's where I met Marsha Gordon, our president and CEO. And about seven years ago, Marsha and I started working together. And now I'm the ex I've been the executive vice president and COO of the Business Council for going on eight years. Well, we follow you every Monday on WVOX. Uh, your show is just ahead of our show on, on uh, Sons of America Legion Radio. What's the best thing about uh, uh, what the Business Council uh, does to support its members here in, the, in Westchester County? Well, we, 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 we're laser focused on helping them succeed. We're laser focused on helping them, as I said, build those relationships, build their portfolio, uh, advocate for them so that government isn't getting in the way sometimes and also helping them when they can and so again we have a what we like to say is we have a daily pulse on what's happening with our members every day it's great john rabbits from the business council westchester good to see you and uh, congratulations on a terrific business expo well, thank you for being here and thank you for continuing to do the work that you do for businesses all over westchester our pleasure this is ken kreitzer for cbsi services in rye new york